If you want to change your life in 2024, it takes this one thing you got to do. Raise your standards. Your standards are the things that determine the quality of the life you're living right now. As human beings, we usually end up falling to the level of our standards. But for some people out there, they're individuals, their standards are to excel, to go beyond what is expected of them, to have more than enough, to not just serve those they care about, but to amaze them. In order to get to that level, you have got to start expecting more from yourself. Stop letting yourself off the hook so easily. You know you can do more. You know you can be more. You know you have more fight in you. If you think you're just going to dream big and wake up to everything being perfect, you're dead wrong. Life's going to knock you down again and again. It's going to test your dreams, pushing you to see if you've really got what it takes. It's going to hurt like hell. It's going to strip you to your core, but it isn't meant to break you. These trials are there to show what you're made of, to push out the real you. It's there to push the greatness that's on the inside of you out. So you've got to start pushing yourself to strive for not just completion, but perfection. Doing things to the very best of your ability. Doing things better than anyone is willing to you get to a point where you don't care how many hours it takes how much effort it requires you just do what you know you need to do in order to create results that will make your life better in the long run those winners in life embrace challenges they don't shy away from tough situations they see them as opportunities to grow stronger. Where others see obstacles, winners see stepping stones to victory. They tackle problems head on, without any hesitation, because they know that overcoming challenges is what makes them better. you to control what you think about and fill your mind with positive thoughts. If you don't choose what to think about, life will choose for you. Pay attention to how you talk to yourself and believe that you are more than capable. You were meant to do this. You need to wake up and realize the amount of effort you're leaving on the table and all the possibilities you have right now become more. You can do me and have so much more than you do right now, but you've got to see that for yourself because until you do, you're not going to change anything. I want you to go find out what your life could look like if you stop paying attention to the cost of every action you're making and started paying attention to the possibilities for working harder. What would your life be like if you started to force yourself to work more hours, to study harder, to do more reps? Question yourself on this, and then go do everything in your power to go find out. You need to be patient and engage in consistent action. Big changes don't happen overnight. Your dreams and dream life is like planting a garden. You plant the seeds, water them, and wait. It takes a lot of time and consistently caring for them and nurturing them for it to grow. So you got to keep feeding your dreams, putting in the daily efforts to step toward them. Slowly but surely, your efforts will pay off in the long run. But you have to give it time and attention. You'll like your life. Change it. You got the power to change the dynamics of your life. You don't have to just take it. Just like whatever it is, it is. No, do not accept that. If you always do what you've always done, you're going to always be where you've always been. Disruption is having the courage to break out of the box. Break out of the box of normalcy. Break out of the box of complacency. Break out of the box of your comfort. Success is not a comfortable procedure. You got to become comfortable with being uncomfortable. If you ever want to be successful, you can't have a new life until you have the courage to disrupt your old life. As long as you won't disrupt what you told yourself you deserve in this world, you will never have an opportunity to walk into what is possible for you. 
what you're doing, the effort you're putting in, the dream you're chasing, the belief you have for that vision of your future has to be so strong that it blocks out everyone else's disbelief. You get to the point where anyone else's opinions or judgments on what you're doing bounces right off you and has no effect on the moves you're making. You gotta start with small steps. The journey of a thousand miles starts with a single step. So work on the immediate steps you can take right now today to move yourself forward. Forget about tomorrow. Forget about what happened yesterday. What are you gonna do today to positively create momentum in the direction you want to head? They keep talking and you keep working. They gossip and make jokes and you keep working. They keep focusing on everything and everyone else and you keep working. And years from now, they'll look over at you and your life and realize that they have nothing left to talk shit about. Because while they were focused on tearing other people down, people like you were focused on building something great of your own. And you have to remember, Everyone makes mistakes when trying new things. Mistakes are okay. They're how you learn, how you develop. What's important is that you keep going, keep trying, and don't ever give up. You'll fall flat on your face so many times. People will laugh at you. They'll make fun of you. But as long as you keep trying and keep getting back up and going at it, you'll be the last one laughing. Because you will make more progress than those other people ever will. Every time you try something different and go at it again, you're one step closer to the life you want. So you gotta go for it. Dare to disrupt your old ways. Believe in yourself and the amazing things you know you can do if you really tried your hardest. The key is to keep your focus inward. Work on improving yourself, chasing your dreams, and building your future. Let your success and your achievements be your response to their disbelief and negativity. Remember, true winners focus on their own lane, building their path to greatness, undeterred by the distractions around them. You'll constantly keep, you'll constantly keep getting better so that you are never stuck in one place for the rest of your life. You're gonna find a way or make a way and you'll stop at nothing to get it. This is Ben Lionel Scott telling you, no matter how hard it is or how hard it gets, declare to 